on to a big announcement from Oklahoma City University. It comes at a time when tribal sovereignty is dominating the headlines. The university is launching a new tribal sovereignty institute. News 4's Natalie Clydesdale talked to them about why this is so important for Oklahoma. Well, leaders say this institute will fill a crucial need by providing independent, credible information about the topic of sovereignty. Anytime people can be more knowledgeable about tribal sovereignty and as well as state law and how those come together, that's what's going to be the key to success. That's the goal for the new Tribal Sovereignty Institute coming to Oklahoma City University School of Law in downtown OKC where 10% of current students are Native American tribal members. Tuesday morning's announcement made at the 36th Annual Sovereignty Symposium. And it would be a logical next step if we could extend the work of this symposium year-round. There is a need in Oklahoma for independent, credible scholarship about tribal sovereignty. This comes as tribal leaders say they see sovereignty issues daily. We need to be at a point where we don't continue to revisit the same issues. The conflicts that arise aren't always known from one group to the next. And I think sometimes law enforcement on the day-to-day -day basis is what we deal with. Sometimes they don't understand jurisdiction. The Institute's first phase, hiring an executive director who will also be a full-time faculty member at OCU School of Law. Everyone can learn about sovereignty, what it means, what the benefits are, how it can be utilized, and I truly believe this is a great step in Oklahoma City, Natalie Clydesdale, Oklahoma's News 4. And Mayor Holt says he hopes the new director will be selected in time for next year's symposium.